you know, some of the names out there, defensive end, are, you know, guys that I would be interested in, but I just really can't see the investment going there um, just with what we've just paid for Von Miller last year. Um, there's guys like Ngakwe and Clowney out there, um, Carlos Dunlap. There's guys out there, um, but with the investments that we have in Von Miller, in Greg Rousseau, um, Boogie Basham, um, AJ Epinesa, all being high picks, I just don't see this being a position where we can spend um, $10, $15 million a year on a high-level um, edge rusher, which, you know, that's the low end of these contracts for a guy that's going to come in have a meaningful impact. You're looking at $15 million a year for one of these guys, and I just don't see that as realistic. Um, now, do does that mean that I'm completely comfortable at defensive end and I don't think we need to make any investments here? Um, absolutely not. And I I think it's going to be, you know, much to the chagrin of Bill's Mafia, but I... I see a world in which we're making another high draft pick at the defensive end position, um, whether that's you know one of the first three rounds. I could I could very much see this happening, um, and it's kind of a position that you typically have to go earlier rather than later. Um, I think we've seen solid development from Groot. I'm I'm comfortable with him as one of our starting defensive ends. Um, but with Von Miller missing some time this coming season, um, your two guys to replace him opposite of Groot are Epinesa and, and Basham. And uh, I'm not fully comfortable with one of them being slotted into a top two spot. Um, when Von Miller went down this, this past season, we saw Shaq Lawson slide into that that role as being the number two. Um, and he's a free agent right now. Um, so honestly, that's about where my free agent wish list ends for this. Um, I don't think you can afford to make a giant investment. Um, and I absolutely love Shaq Lawson's play last year. And if you're talking about, you know, getting us through eight, 10 games of the, of the regular season, and kind of holding that spot till Vaughn gets back, I'm good with that. Um, I'm comfortable with what Shaq Lawson was able to do last year. If you can bring him back on another, you know, one, two year deal, low money, like we saw last year. Um, and then he becomes your number three when Von Miller's back. I'm good with that. 